Hey, what's going on guys? Robert Walkner here from CoinOp TV. It's February, that means we gotta break down the hot games of February 2014. And I got the list in front of me that I'm gonna go by, give you a little idea what's going on, you know, December, January, not that amazing for video games, but now that it's February, March soon, getting kind of excited to play some video games, to dust off my PS4, dust off that Xbox One, Xbox 360, PlayStation 3, 3DS, Vita, whatever you got. We're going to play some games in February. So let me go down the list. We're going to start off with Earth Defense Force 2025 will be the first week in February. This is going to be coming out for the Xbox 360, PlayStation 3. And then uh, Fable Anniversary is going to be coming out. This is a remastering, HD remastering of the original Fable that was out for the first First Xbox, can't call it the Xbox One, the first Xbox. It's going to be back again for the Xbox 360. Then, now I'm very excited for this. The Lego Movie is coming out in theaters in February and we're going to have the Lego Movie video game for everything. It's going to be a Windows PC, PS3, Xbox 360, PS4, Xbox One. One thing about those LEGO games is now they're releasing them for all the generations, the new gen, the old gen. I'm excited. I got to check out some of this game last year at Comic-Con. It looked really fun. All right, so then up next is going to be Outlast for the PlayStation 4. Outlast is a first-person survival horror game set in an asylum. And then we got Bravely Default coming out. It's a Japanese role-playing game from Square Enix uh, for the Nintendo 3DS. And uh, I guess technically this is the spiritual successor to the 2010 video game Final Fantasy The Four Heroes of Light. Never played that, so guys let me know if you played that in the comments below what you thought of that game. Took it in The Age of Demons. Haven't really heard anything about this game, but apparently it's a third person monster hunting game which employs a group of players or NPCs fighting together against various monsters during quests. So that kind of sounds kind of fun. Uh, a game I did hear about is One Piece Romance Dawn, which is going to be going to be coming out for the Nintendo 3DS. And uh, it's it's you know unlike this is more of an RPG game, unlike the One Piece fighting games that we've seen on consoles. All right, up next we got a PS Vita game. Now apologies if I don't say this correctly, but I think it's Dangarumpa Trigger Happy Havoc. Haven't really heard much about this game. Uh, apparently it's a murder mystery novel or something like that, similar to the Ace Attorney series so you know let me know if you guys are familiar with that game and then another game that that i've heard of that i've played that i'm very excited about rayman legends will be ported over to next gen will be coming out for the playstation 4 the xbox one if you never played rayman origins rayman legends pick these games up side scroll and fun cartoony wacky great special effects great graphics sound effects great co-op can't say enough about the Rayman, the new reboot of the Rayman games. Um, speaking of uh, co-op and side-scrollers, um, February 21st we have Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze for the Nintendo Wii U. This is the big Nintendo Wii U game, first party game that's coming out. We know about it, we've seen it. Sky Side-scrollers there, play with all your favorite Donkey Kong Country characters, that's going to be fun. And then uh, also we got Castlevania Lords of Shadow 2 coming out for Windows PC, Xbox 360, and the PlayStation 3. Got some trailers of Castlevania Lords of Shadow on the trail. I'm very excited because uh, um, Picard from Star Trek, uh, Mr. Mr. Patrick Stewart is going to be a voice in this game. And just anything that he lends his voice to is usually is really has a good punch to it. I'm very excited. Another big game coming out, or at least I think is a big game, Plants vs. Zombie Garden Warfare. This is going to be an Xbox One game, and then I believe also on the Xbox 360. Uh, I believe it's going to be, from what I understand, it's multiplayer only. Jump on your friends, blast at your zombies or your garden plants. Uh, we got a trailer up there on the YouTube channel, so make sure you check that out. All right, so up next we have Tales of Sifania Chronicles, which is an HD remastering of the PS2 game called Tales of Sifania, and then it also includes the Nintendo Wii game, Tales of Sifania Dawn of the New World. Haven't played these at all, either one of these, but, you know, they're coming out now for the PlayStation 3, so you can get your hands on them. Then up next, a game I'm really excited about. I got to check out some at E3 last year, Thief. Very, very excited for Thief. Dishonored, uh, a couple years ago, was one of my favorite games. I just like the stealth aspect of Dishonored. And Thief is a reboot of the Thief franchise, I guess. And it looks kind of similar to Dishonored with kind of that stealth gameplay and kind of giving you a lot of choices of how you want to move around the landscape. 
So I'm really looking forward to getting inside of Garrett's shoes there for Thief and playing some of that in February. All right, so next up we got Divinity Original Sin. I haven't played any of Original Sin yet. It's a single player or a co-op multiplayer fantasy role-playing game. Uh, then after that, Professor Layton and the Azrin Legacy. It's a puzzle game split into multiple chapters for the Nintendo 3DS. You guys are familiar with the Professor Layton games there. And then Resident Evil 4 is going to get the ultimate HD edition uh, coming out for... Um, Windows PC, Mac, PlayStation 3, um, you know, multiple platforms. We're going to get the uh, Resident Evil 4 back again, which a lot of people claim is one of the best Resident Evil games. So I'll be curious. Let me know in the comments, you know, what your favorite Resident Evil game is. And then finally, and I think this is going to be February, we're going to get another chapter, another episode of The Wolf Among Us, uh, episode two, Smoke and Mirrors. All right, so now I want to show you guys a little teaser, a little glimpse of my three picks for February 2014. While you're watching that, maybe you can jump in the comments below. Let me know what your picks are for February 2014 for video games. Let's check out some of those clips right now. Everybody, I'm here. Batman? 